Cardano, a new way to develop the cryptocurrency? Every day there are hundreds if not thousands of articles about Bitcoin, BitHeroim, ICOs, and how blockchain technology will fundamentally change the world. But within the clamor surrounding this new technology, and its applications, there has been a remarkable lack of news and analysis on some of the relatively smaller cryptocurrencies and blockchain platforms. One of the most important of these smaller cryptocurrencies is Cardano. Cardano is similar to Ethereum in that it is primarily being developed as a platform for decentralized applications, but it is being developed in a remarkably different way. Centralized development What is very different about the way Cardano is being developed is that it has a core team of experts from around the world with a clear direction of growth. This sets it apart from something like Bitcoin because it allows for a much greater control over the developmental progress of the platform. There are clear advantages to taking this approach. It allows for the development team to prioritize the scalability and utility of the platform rather than maintaining AS market cap. This in stark contrast to Bitcoin where the inability to further fork and develop the utility of the cryptocurrency, such as with the proposed SegWit2x hard fork, raises questions over its long-term use. This focus on development and long-term utility is also shown by the way that Cardano is being developed in layers. By building the cryptocurrency in layers, it allows for the team to upgrade the platform in a way that is not disruptive to the platform and allows for maximum use cases. Clear development What also sets Cardano apart is the clear path it is taking in its development because it is being developed, in essence, by a centralized core team working in unison. Cardano has a much clearer path than others. Indeed, Cardano's roadmap is very clearly shown on its own website with each step as progress shared with the community. This allows people to see exactly what is being enacted by the developers and the level of progress that is being made in each step. This is rare in the cryptocurrency world, a world in which development schedules and specifics are often opaque, especially in terms of presenting information to the wider public. A new way. Will this herald a new, more open system of development in the cryptocurrency domain? That is not clear, as of yet. Cardano is still in the very early stages of development, and, Although ADA is the fifth largest cryptocurrency by market cap, it is still unclear whether Cardano's development will result in the development of applications with concrete utility. What is clear is that Cardano has a clear development direction and may help to make the development process for other cryptocurrencies or blockchain-based technologies more open and transparent. Monero, an alternative to Bitcoin. With the world of cryptocurrencies being heavily populated by a wide range of different coins, it would be easy to focus on the big names in the market. Bitcoin is the obvious example, yet at her and Ripple have consistently featured in the headlines too. It therefore seems appropriate to dedicate some attention to the lesser known cryptocurrencies that have also been able to benefit from the hype surrounding the market. One such example is Monero, meaning coin in Esperanto, a decentralized cryptocurrency that prides itself on its privacy. Created in April 2014, Monero has seen exponential growth since sitting at $16.38 at the start of 2017 reaching a high of $542.33 on January 9, 2018. And amongst its crypto peers, Monero ranks highly 
enjoying a market capitalization of around $4 billion, placing it 13th in terms of size. This can be attributed to Monero's distinctive ability to deliver a service that provides privacy for its users, giving it an advantage over many of the other cryptocurrencies out there and allowing Monero to establish itself within the market, reflected by its position as the most valuable privacy-focused cryptocurrency. Anonymous transactions compared to other cryptocurrencies, Monero offers its users a high level of privacy through an opaque blockchain record of transactions. There are three main elements to ensure that transactions stay anonymized. Firstly, the sender's address is mixed with several others obtained from the blockchain in order to create more difficulty when tracking the source of a transaction. Further, stealth addresses are generated in order to hide the destination of the transaction. Lastly, the amount of the transaction is also kept private. These combine to ensure that users are able to remain unknown, therefore creating a unique quality for Monero as a cryptocurrency. This has proved popular, although mostly amongst those interested in illegal activities. As a currency to be traded, Monero is the natural choice of those that want to keep their purchase history private, filling a definite, if not questionable, gap in the market. Mushroom Power Monero is also fungible this means that each unit of currency is exactly equivalent to every other unit, essentially making them substitutable. This isn't the case for those cryptocurrencies with a transparent blockchain, such as Bitcoin. As a transaction history is readily available for these currencies, those coins associated with undesired activities, such as theft, tend to be avoided by merchants. However, given the anonymous transactions that exist with Monero, coins are indistinguishable from each other, thus meaning that, in the eyes of the individual, each coin is worth the same. This gives Monero an advantage. As all coins are mixed and identical, there is no need to assume that any one coin is dirty. The requirement of all transactions to be private therefore works to the benefit of all users and allows individuals to participate in their desired activities with no questions asked about the legitimacy of their coins. Efficiency gains Monero can be seen to be a more efficient cryptocurrency than Bitcoin and other competitors. Firstly, Monero allows the user to produce a block in an average time of 2 minutes, compared to Bitcoin's 10 minutes. It can also boast average transaction fees of around $3, versus $20 for Bitcoin. Lastly, Monero does not require any specific chips to be installed, meaning that any computer is capable of mining. This creates a larger demographic of individuals that Monero can appeal to, especially given that many chips can be costly to purchase. Quicker, cheaper, simpler everything points in favor of Monero. Final thoughts for the right individual, Monero is an incredibly attractive cryptocurrency. With its focus on privacy and fungibility, it is able to provide a service unmatched by most other currencies including Bitcoin, therefore allowing it to carve out niche within the market. It also allows users a faster process, ensuring a more convenient and efficient product. So could it overtake Bitcoin? It seems possible given that there will always be a market for illegal activities and given the strength of the service itself. However, arguably this exact point may put off your average crypto kid, limiting Monero's growth to some extent compared to more popular currencies such as Bitcoin. Nevertheless, as long as there is demand for privacy, there will be demand for Monero.
2x hard fork raises questions over its long-term use. This focus on development and long-term utility is also shown by the way that Cardano is being developed in layers. By building the cryptocurrency in layers, it allows for the team to upgrade the platform in a way that is not disruptive to the platform and allows for maximum use cases. Clear development What also sets Cardano apart is the clear path it is taking in its development. Because it is being developed, in essence, by a centralized core team working in unison, Cardano has a much clearer path than others. Indeed, Cardano's roadmap is very clearly shown on its own website with each step as progress shared with the community. This allows people to see exactly what is being enacted by the developers, and the level of progress that is being made in each step. This is rare in the cryptocurrency world a world in which development schedules and specifics are often opaque, especially in terms of presenting information to the wider public. A new way. Will this herald a new, more open system of development in the cryptocurrency domain? That is not clear, as of yet. Cardano is still in the very early stages of development, and, although it ADA is the fifth largest cryptocurrency by market cap, it is still unclear whether Cardano's development will result in the development of applications. Cardano, a new way to develop a cryptocurrency? Every day there are hundreds if not thousands of articles about Bitcoin, Bitcoin, ICOs, and how blockchain technology will fundamentally change the world. But within the clamor surrounding this new technology, and its applications, there has been a remarkable lack of news and analysis on some of the relatively smaller cryptocurrencies and blockchain platforms. One of the most important of these smaller cryptocurrencies is Cardano. Cardano is similar to Ethereum in that it is primarily being developed as a platform for decentralized applications, but it is being developed in a remarkably different way. Centralized development What is very different about the way Cardano is being developed is that it has a core team of experts from around the world with a clear direction of growth. This sets it apart from something like Bitcoin because it allows for a much greater control over the developmental progress of the platform. There are clear advantages to taking this approach. It allows for the development team to prioritize the scalability and utility of the platform, rather than maintaining ADA's market cap. This in stark contrast to Bitcoin, where the inability to further fork and develop the utility of the cryptocurrency, such as with the proposed segwittons with concrete utility. What is clear is that Cardano has a clear development direction and may help to make the development process for other cryptocurrencies or blockchain-based technologies more open and transparent. Monero, an alternative to Bitcoin with the world of cryptocurrencies being heavily populated by a wide range of different coins, it would be easy to focus on the big names in the market. Bitcoin is the obvious example, yet at Heroim and Ripple have consistently featured in the headlines too. It therefore seems appropriate to dedicate some attention to 